Well, here's a story we have been talking about all night in the newsroom. And you joined the conversation on Facebook. Do you tip on to the go orders from restaurants as well, we look at our comments? That's right. A recently fired Outback Steakhouse server you're looking at here posted on social media after a local mega church, she says, did not tip her on a $700 takeout bill. Only on five. Andrew Law home live for us with why the server says no regrets. Andrew. That's right, she wanted to share her story with us to help raise awareness, saying that this happens far too often. She wanted to speak up on behalf of her and fellow servers to remind people that those tips they rely on so much for their livelihood. Wednesday night, Christ Fellowship Church called in a $735 delivery order from Outback. A church member said Outback was running late, so they sent a volunteer to pick it up. Tamlin Yoder helped with the takeout order. I brought it out, put it in the car, we received the payment, there was no gratuity. I got upset. I posted a post on Facebook about the church not leaving a gratuity tip. A friend of Tamlin saw the post and called Christ Fellowship to complain the next day. The church said the volunteers sent to pick up the food didn't know about its policy to tip on takeout orders. Coming in to eat or take out, you should automatically be wanting to tip 15%. From there, you either go up or go down based on service. So try to make it right, the church called Outback Thursday. When Tamlin showed up to work, she was fired. Outback's policy does not allow social media posts about customers. I feel that we should be allowed to say something, especially to big parties that don't leave anything, that pay the exact amount. I, I still feel the same way and I probably still do it the same way today. I wouldn't change anything. Christ Fellowship says it never intended for anyone to lose their job. The church did reach out to me and that they are trying to rectify the whole thing. A Tamlin says she's working on finding a new job. She wants to continue uh, being a waitress and a server. And one day she hopes to, hopes to open up her own restaurant. We're live Andrew Law from WPTV News Channel 5.